You've always wondered which zodiac is best at gaming, but never had the time to research it. Now, you don't have to. Today, we're going to rank all 12 zodiac signs based on their gaming skills. This is a very important issue that needs addressing so everybody can finally know what they're up against when playing Fortnite with their friends. Let's get started. Aries. Aries is the worst at gaming because they are too impulsive and don't think things through. They often rush into situations without considering the consequences, which leads them to making mistakes and losing games. Additionally, Aries can be arrogant and competitive, which can lead them to becoming frustrated easily and throwing tantrums when they lose. Scorpio Scorpio has an extremely dark personality, which makes them very negative when playing games. Since they are pessimistic, Scorpio thinks that everything is unfair and will accuse other people of cheating just to make themselves feel better. Scorpio might even go so far as to destroy controllers or throw their computer out of a window in anger if they lose, making it not worth playing with them at all. Leo Leo is one of the worst signs at gaming because they take everything too seriously. Leo fails to see the enjoyment in any game and only cares about playing perfectly instead of having fun. They care so much about winning that they will often try to control everyone else's playstyle so they can win more easily. Since they are extremely self-centered, Leo doesn't want to cooperate or work together with others and they will often leave a game if another player is playing better than them. Gemini Geminis have a lot of energy, so they can seem like fun to play with. However, they will randomly change their mind on a whim, which makes it extremely difficult to predict how they will behave in any given situation. A Gemini often feels the need to prove themselves and show everyone what they're capable of doing. If you were to have a Gemini on your team, they would often try to overcompensate by not obeying the rules of a game and doing their own thing instead. Capricorn Capricorn has a hard time playing games that require high levels of creativity. They are extremely reserved and don't like to make mistakes in front of others, making it difficult for them to get into the game's atmosphere. Capricorn is also very strict with rules and will always try to enforce fairness between all players. This makes it easy for others to take advantage of them and, in the long run, will not be a lot of fun for anyone involved. Sagittarius while they may not be the most hardcore gamers, Sagittarius does have a lot of potential. Since they are very friendly and love to help others, if you were to play with them, it would make everything easier. Players will often go for Sagittarius first because they can't shoot straight. Shotgun aiming is their worst nightmare. However, they are easy to walk all over because they are too friendly for their own good. Pisces Pisces is very unfocused when it comes to video games. Because they have so many interests, they tend to spread themselves too thin and always have at least one project going on at a time. That being said, if Pisces does decide to focus all their attention on the game, they could be quite good at it. Unfortunately for them, they don't have the patience to become a professional gamer and sometimes suffer from a lack of motivation. Libra Libra is very indecisive and as such, it's very difficult for them to focus on a single activity. When they attempt to play a video game, their brain goes haywire trying to decide who gets what items, weapons, etc., which can cause a lot of trouble for the group. If Libra manages to focus everything on the game, they could become fairly good. However, because of their indecisiveness, it's unlikely they will stick with the game long enough to become skilled. Aquarius Aquarius is somewhat of an enigma. While they are very smart, it's difficult to anticipate what they are going to do next, making them rather unpredictable. This can be a good thing or a bad thing, depending on the gameplay you're looking for and how much fun your opponents want. They absolutely love games that involve building and construction and will always focus on those types of games. Cancer Cancer is a natural leader and has the ability to take control of any situation. They don't always lead in a positive way, however. If they aren't having fun, they will make sure everyone around them isn't having fun either, which can be very disruptive during group games. Cancer also tends to micromanage every aspect of the game, which can really get on people's nerves. If they're happy and relaxed, Cancer is one of the best gamers to play with or against. Taurus Taurus is slow to anger, but once they get mad, they stay mad. Because of this, it's difficult for them to play games with a lot of tension or stress involved. They are more likely to spend their time playing multiplayer games where there isn't as much pressure. One benefit Taurus has when playing video games is their sense of direction. They are incredibly gifted in games where you have to find your way around, making them an asset when it comes to solving puzzles or navigating mazes. Virgo 
Virgo is the perfectionist of the zodiac and often puts more pressure on themselves than their opponents or teammates do. Because they are so hard on themselves, it's difficult for them to let go of mistakes. It can cause them to become even more upset when things don't go well, which makes it difficult to play games that require teamwork. Virgo also has a strong tendency to be critical, which can really hurt morale during group games. That being said, if Virgo finds the right group of people to play with and learns how to control their emotions, they can become amazing gamers. There you have it. The 12 zodiac signs ranked from worst to best when it comes to gaming. While some signs may struggle more than others, everyone has the potential to be a great gamer with enough practice and dedication. What do you think of our ranking? Let us know in the comments below. Check out this video, Zodiac Signs That Don't Get Along At All. And I'll see you in the next video.